we are going to be doing 12 days of Grey Movies challenges to get in the Christmas spirit. Wow! 12 days of us doing challenges. Of us doing stupid stuff. Are you excited? I'm very excited. Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> Oh, oh man, that's so bright. Welcome back to another day of our challenges. Yeah! Let's get started. Today we are doing the Speech, Speech Jammer, Jammer Challenge. Challenge. <laughs> nice. <laughs> There's no punishment for this one. This is just a normal challenge where we put on the Speech Jammer app and see how well we can say words without screwing up. We each have the app uploaded onto our iPhones and we are going to try to talk and say things without messing up. If you guys have seen this play before, if you have not, you can click right down here. We'll put a link to that. Played it a little um, while ago. And we also have, almost a year ago at this point, I think. Yeah, February, I believe. Maybe January. So, yeah, we have the, uh, I'll have the link in the description below, and if you're watching on a computer or desktop device, I have the, the box playing right here, playing the video. You can click on the video and watch it if you want to see that before this. It was worse quality because we were filming with our flip camera, but, yeah, whatever happens, happens, right? So, um, let's get started with this. All right, I'll go first. Um, all right. Oh, boy, this is going to be interesting. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, whoa, wait. Yeah, whoa. Yeah. Okay. In shoulder surgery, some surgeons just saw social social shoulders by a rehabilitation McDonald doctor. Wow. Um, I want to do it one more time. I want to do it one more. I think I can do it this time. Uh, Did I mess it up that badly? It, it was like you were having a stroke. In shoulder surgery, is some surgeons. <laughs> oh. Okay. 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 In shoulder surgery, the some searchers su 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 by a rear bit da da da. This is so hard. The actual tongue twister says in in goodness gracious, I cannot say. It's this hard to say normal. Yeah, in shoulder surgery, some surgeons sew soldiers' shoulders by a rehabilitation medical doctor. <laughs> that end part makes no sense. <laughs> Your turn to do a tongue twister. Oh wow. Sure sir, the ship sure, ship shape sir. One more time. Alright. Sure sir, the ship sure, ship shape sir. <laughs> I think they pretty much got that, but if you can take it off and uh, say the actual one. It says, sure sir, the ship's sure, ship shape sir. And so that one was pretty easy. That was ridiculous. That it was so short. I can't wait till you get some harder ones. You got rehabilitation. I can't. I, I have a hard time saying that normally. Oh, that's a short one. Yes, yeah, it's short. Okay. I'm probably gonna screw this. Up. I'm so bad with words anyway. So <laughs> he's bad with words. I do, I don't do speak good. Okay. So here we go. This is the next the next one for me. That was that was so weird. Okay, so as soon as I started recording, I heard that it was like, whoop. it was like, <laughs> was like what? So oh, it's probably me. <laughs> <laughs> this is the six zebra snoozing thoroughly. Thoroughly. This is the six zebra snoozing thoroughly. If you guys couldn't understand that, like, this is the sixth zebra snoozing thoroughly. It's, it's funnier when you just go through it as quickly as you can. No, We're actually trying, though. We're trying. Let's, let's not. Let's not try to. Right. <laughs> Somebody said Yvette. Yvette. <laughs> Yvette. I gratefully gaze at the gracefully grazing gazelles. Dang. That was pretty good. Oh, wow. I gratefully gazed at the gracefully gazing gazelles. Okay. So apparently you're good at speak. If you guys could not clearly understand that as clearly as he was saying it. I gratefully gazed at the gracefully ga grazing gazelle. You said it better with the jammer on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the heck? I'm so stupid. Oh, this is easy. What the short? All right. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I put it on and I went like, and it comes through so well. I hear, I hear my, I hear my ears. I hear. <laughs> so disgusting. We're gonna make a comment every time we put these things on. 
It's not that funny. <laughs> a quick-witted crick. A quick-witted critic cricket kit 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 kit. A quick-witted critic cricket crick. A quick-witted cricket kit cricket. A quick-witted critic cricket. I cannot say it. I cannot. A quick-witted critic cricket kit. Ah! So the actual thing is a quick-witted cricket critic. A quick-witted critic cricket. A quick. Yeah, that's a short one, but it's hard. It's hard one, yeah. All right. How much ground could a groundhog grind if a groundhog could, could grind ground? <laughs> it sounded good up until the very end. Yeah. How much ground could a groundhog grind if a groundhog could grind grind ground? <laughs> you had to say the actual one. How much ground could a groundhog grind if a groundhog could grind ground? Fairly simple. Who has ever said that? All right, so now we are moving on. Oh no. That's bull. I can't even say this one normally. Get Jesus. Let alone, oh gosh, dang it. You, you guys already know what it is. Now that I said she sells. Okay, here we go. She sells sea sells shells on the sea seashore. The sea shells sells, 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 sells on the sea seashore. So sea she shells. She sells C. Eh, low power mode. She sells C C shells on the C C C C shore. The C shells C C shells are C C shore C C shells. My my favorite part is when you're like, she sells C shell 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 shells. I cannot say this to save my life regularly. It is, she sells C. She sells, she sells seashells on the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashore sh seashells. So that's really stupid. Oh my gosh. Wow, um... Good luck. I might have a stroke just from speaking. In confusion. <laughs> that one was wet. Turn it on, and the first thing I hear is, Ugh, uh, uh, that was wet. <laughs> if Pickford's Packers packed a packet of crisp, would the packet of crisps that Pickford Packers packed survive for two and a half years? From Naomi Fletcher's real life. That actually wasn't that bad. There were a few, there were a few rough moments in there, but I'm gonna be completely honest, that was not terrible. Who is Naomi Fletcher? <laughs> If Pickford's Packers packed a packet of crisps, would the packet of crisps that Pickford's Packers packed survive for two and a half years? From Naomi Fletcher's real life. You have those tall vowels here. From Naomi Fletcher's real life. If Pickford's Packers packed a packet of crisps, would the packet of crisps that Pickford's Packers packed survive for two and a half years? Caution, this game makes you stupid. <laughs> oh yes, lettuce. We'll just go with it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Go! <laughs> I love this game. I love it so much. 1-1 one, one was a racehorse. 2-2 two, two is 1-2. One, 1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1
Are you joking? I'm not joking. Red blood, green blood. It's so easy. All right, and for those of you who quite the... And for those of you who can't hear, red blood, green blood. If you couldn't hear that, you're, you're deaf. That was so easy. Hmm? What? Hmm? What? Hmm? What? Ah! Oh my gosh. So I get red blood, green blood, and Parker gets a paragraph. Dr. Johnson, Mr. Johnson, after great can get a consideration, came, came to the conclusion then that the Indian, Indian nation is beyond the, the Indian Ocean. <laughs> Is back in education piece because this chief of occupation is cultivation. One more time. Dr. Johnson and Mr. Johnson, after great consideration, came to the conclusion that the Indian, 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 Indian Ocean, uh, that the Indian, Indian nation beyond the Indian, Indian own ocean is back in education because the chief occupation is cultivation. <laughs> that was amazing. And the paragraph reads, Dr. Johnson and Mr. Johnson, after great consideration, came to the conclusion that the Indian nation beyond the Indian Ocean is back in education because the chief occupation is cultivation. Red blood, green blood. <laughs> this one's short too. Uh -huh. Tommy Tucker tried to tie Tammy Turtle's tie. One more time. Tommy Tucker tried to tie Tammy Turtle's tie. And for those of you who are deaf, Tommy Tucker tried to tie Tammy's turtle tie. I don't know what the heck a turtle tie is. <laughs> this is the last one for both of us. So I do one more, and then he does one more, and we're done. This is so much fun, though, and I want to do this again in the future. This is so much fun. This is a great way to laugh at your stupid friend who's always like, Hey! Okay. I know, I know this one. I know this one. I'm still probably gonna mess it up. I'm gonna sing it. There's a, there's a song for it that Grandma sings a lot of times. Uh -huh. um, <clears throat> Mares eat oats and does eat oats and little lambs eat ivy. A kiddly divey too, wouldn't you? The kiddly divey too part is not. It's from a pre-war English musical song. And so Thanks, if, Grandma. This, if this one's too easy, I will do another one. Mares eat oats and tindos eat oats and the lambs eat ivy. A kiddly divey too too would who wouldn't, didn't you? Mares eat oats and oats and oats eat oats and oats and oats and oats and oats and little little lambs eat ivy. From a pre-war English Miss Musical Hall song. It's hard. I'm gonna try and speak it instead of sing it this time. Mares eat oats and dozy 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 oats. What? Mares eat oats and dozy do oats, but little lambs eat ivy ivy. From a pre-war English song, musical song. That was a good last one for me. All right. It's another woodchuck thing. Oh my gosh. How many snacks could a snack stack harder stack? <laughs> if a snack stacker snack snack stack. What? How many snacks could a snack stacker stack? If a snack stacker snack stack snacks. By Christine Reynolds. One more time for the people. How many snacks could a snack stacker stack? If a snack stacker snack stack snack stack stacks. By Christine Reynolds. <laughs> all right, and then for all the people, for who, all the deaf people, for all the people who speak normally, that's not for the deaf people. That was actually that was actually pretty difficult. That what are you talking about? That actually sounded pretty. Back, step, back, back, back. That actually sounded very different from what it was supposed to be. So if he's going to say it. If you didn't understand it. You're not deaf. You were in the same room as us. How many snacks could a snack stacker stack? If a snack stacker snack stack snacks. By Christine Reynolds. Thanks, Christine Reynolds. Well, poisoning the minds of children. Interesting stuff going on. Oh, yeah. 
All right, and we would like to thank you once again for watching our 12 days of Christmas challenges. Thank you so much for sticking around with us. For uh, another challenge, the Speech Jammer Challenge, which was a lot of fun. Uh, if you would like to subscribe, I'm going to use the Force because Star Wars is coming out soon. I'm going to use the Force to levitate this up. Whoa! Isn't that so cool? Whoa! Totally not the Force Awakens sponsorship! Whoa! So yeah, there's the subscribe button right up here. And uh, if you would like to watch more videos, click on our chests. I got the vlogs on mine, and Connor's got the skits on his. <laughs> we'll sit here for a second and let you guys click on whatever you want. Thanks again for watching. We will link any videos that we have referenced in this one in the description below. Thank you so much. Please tell your friends about us, subscribe, watch our videos, and we will see you next time.